Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm doing a holiday home decor haul. It's nothing crazy because I live in a one bedroom condo, so I can't like get a whole bunch of crazy decorations because then I don't have anywhere to put them after. So these are just a few things that I've picked up and I'm gonna be doing another video where I actually show you guys a couture and like how I actually use these things to decorate. So there will be like a part two of this video. But for now, we'll just get started. Sorry, I just had a coughing fit, but I'm back. So um, I guess I'll just start with candles, actually. So the first holiday items I got um, are some Bath and Body Works candles. I pretty much get these every year and I actually still have some from last year so I don't know why I bought more but they smell so good so this first one this is going to be for my bathroom it's the frosted coconut snowball candle this is the packaging it's very cute it looks like this on the top this smells delightful it definitely has like a coconut scent but more like a sweet scent I don't know it just smells really good and these kind of scents I like for the bathroom because they're not like like bakery scents to me that's like a weird thing to have in your bathroom so definitely this is a good one and then I got the spiced gingerbread this will be like for my living room kitchen. Um, this one smells amazing. It definitely has a very strong gingerbread scent, which I like, and it's not too sweet. Sometimes the Bath and Body Works candles are way too sugary, and like you just have to turn them off because they're so fragrant. But this one smells pretty good so far, so we'll see how it burns but yeah I'm excited about these oh I should show you up close right this is the packaging and that's the lid same as the other one so I think when I bought these they were $13.50 each I think they're 15 normally I don't even know anymore because it seems like Bath and Body Works has a different sale every day and I just I can't keep up I'm pretty sure I could have gotten an even better deal, but yeah. So those are the two candles. Um, so sticking with candles, I have these. These are actually, they're made of wax, or they at least have like a wax coating, but they are battery operated. I mean, it's hard to tell on camera, but they look like a real wick because this like plastic part there's like a thing inside here and it moves it makes the flame or it makes the light look like it's actually moving you can't tell on camera but I'm sure you've seen these around they're like very popular this year and actually these are like a dupe that my mom found because we went to Pottery Barn and that's where we saw these and it was like for a candle like this big, it was like, I'm not even kidding, $84 for one candle. For an, a candle that's not even real. I was like, what's going on? So <laughs> she found these, I think in a set of five. So she gave me these two and she kept some for herself. But I think I want my own set. Because the set actually comes with a remote and... I think you can like put them on different settings or something so yeah I don't know what I'm gonna do with these yet I think I'm gonna put them on the floor like near my fireplace uh, because I have something else that's really cute that's gonna go there so yeah those are my candles do I have any more no that's it um, so I also got these lights these are by Philips they're called dewdrop lights so basically they're like on a very thin wire so you can form them around things 
These ones look like little um, Christmas, what do you call those? Ornaments. <laughs> and they're battery operated. I don't know for sure what I want to do with these yet, but probably put them around my fireplace, like where the stockings will go. And I also got these ones. They're like um, point, what do you call those? Poinsettias. I'm pretty sure I'm pronouncing that correctly. Yeah, so, and they're both warm white lights, it says. Yeah, I'm excited to see what these look like. In the store, there was like a button you could press that showed you and it looked pretty cute. And I got these on a really good deal. They were like $4 each, so. And they're six feet in length. So I will be showing you guys what these look like. And these ones have like bells on them. So that's fun. And I wanted to show you guys like a little hack that I thought about. I don't know, maybe you already know about this, but they have these magnets hooks. Um, I found these ones on Amazon. I was looking for these everywhere and I couldn't find them. I don't know if it's just where I was looking. So finally I just bought them on Amazon. So these are like the strongest magnets ever. They hold 48 pounds it said and there was some that hold even more. So what I'm going to do with these is because my fireplace is like brick and I don't have like something I can drill things into. Like I don't have like a mantle, is that what it's called on my fireplace? It's just like flat. So I need somewhere to put my stockings. So I got these and I'm gonna stick them to my fireplace, the part around it, and hang my stockings on these. So I'm very excited because last year I got um, like sticky ones and they didn't hold up anything. So yeah, I'm really hoping these work, but I'm pretty sure they will because they're like very sturdy. I guess we'll move on to dish towels. <laughs> I know it's riveting, riveting content on this channel, but um, I'm like obsessed with dish towels. I don't know why. There's just so many cute ones lately. So I found these ones. This is just one of them. So it says farm fresh Christmas trees. It has a little truck with a tree in the back. And it says pine, spruce, fir. So it's different tree types. And this came with like another one, a duplicate of this. And then just like a plain one like this. So that's good because I can use it all year round. But these are so cute and I put one of them in my bathroom and this one goes on my oven. So I don't know, I just really like this theme. This is like the the kind of colors I'm going with this year, I guess. Like pretty basic, I mean red and green obvious Christmas colors, but more like, I don't know, like a farmhouse vibe, I guess, I don't know. But I thought these were really cute and I found them at Winners, which is like TJ Maxx if you're in the States. And they were like $8 for three. And these are like pretty good, like thick towels. So I'm excited about these. And I actually found at Walmart um, the mat that is like the same lettering with the truck. And I put that in my kitchen. But I don't have it with me now and it's pretty like dirty so <laughs> I have to wash it before I show it on camera but yeah I just really like this whole theme and I saw a pillow too like a long pillow with the same like truck on it and I think I want it so I might have to go back to was it Marshall's or Winner's that I I don't know some store like that is where I found these. Since we're talking about dish towels, I went to Anthropology. They were having like a Black Friday kind of sale and I found more dish towels there. <laughs> okay, one of them is not really holiday. I just had to have it though. How cute is this? It says, hello, gorgeous. Isn't that so cute? And it has like pumpkins and 
squashes and different gourds on it. I just think it's so cute. Um, so this is more like a fall towel, of course, so I'm going to put it away for now and bring it back out <laughs> next year. But this one was $22, but it was 30% off. No, it was on sale for $14.95 and then it was 30% off $14.95. So I got a pretty good deal on this. And then I had to get this one. It doesn't really match my other theme, but I had to get it. This one here. It's a little gingerbread man, man meditating. And it says, Om for the holidays. Get it? Om? Yeah, I just had to have this one. So he's like a bit more sparkly and festive. Um, this one, I think it was... 22 and 30 percent off i don't think this one was on sale but i could be wrong i don't remember but he is very cute so i don't know what i'll do with this one i'll have to find somewhere else for him to go yeah well he kind of does he go i mean kind of goes it's all red and green right yeah i don't know very cute also at Anthropology, oh, I wanted to show you this little guy. They were giving out free ornaments, and I thought it was the cutest thing. It's a little sheep with a scarf on, <laughs> and it says Anthropology 2019 on it, so I guess they have these all year round. I just became obsessed with anthropology like a couple weeks ago. I had actually never been inside um, like a big anthropology store before. And then I, like I've always known there's one near me. So I decided to go in and that was a mistake because now I need everything at that store. But yeah, I thought <laughs> this was really cute. So I'm gonna put him on my little tree that I'll show you guys in another video. The last thing I got at Anthropology is actually, again, it's more for fall, but it is this uh, pumpkin spatula thing, and it came with a big pumpkin cookie cutter. Can you even see that very well? So I thought it was super cute, and this was like $5. So obviously I had to get it. And I have um, some things that I want to make pumpkin cookies with. I have got these like pumpkin spice truffles that I want to make into like a kind of chocolate chip cookie. But using pumpkin truffles instead. I don't know. And so I thought this would be really cute if I can make them shape like pumpkins. And I needed a new spatula like this. So yeah, I'm pretty excited about this find and that it was on sale since, you know, it's not the season anymore. And I just realized there's actually a recipe on the back for soft glazed pumpkin cookies. So that's fun. And they had like holiday versions of this, like with the, the gingerbread man, the ohm guy. Um, but I just needed to get the pumpkin one. You guys know. If you know me, you know that I love pumpkin everything. So, yeah. So that was from Anthropology, And the last little guy that I got, I blame this on Angie Belmar. I'll link her channel below. But she does, like, amazing Christmas videos every year. She goes, like, crazy with the decor. And this year, she got these guys. <laughs> so this is a gnome. Um, I should think of a name for him. I don't know though. If you have any suggestions, let me know below. But she found like all kinds of sizes of these guys at Marshall's, I think it was. Like some of them are huge and then there's like all different size and they go down to like small, very small ones. But I got this little guy and they're weighted on the bottom so you can like put them um, on the floor or like on a couch or something and I just thought he was so cute so he's gonna go like with the stockings and everything around the fireplace 
and I will show you guys what that looks like. But I had to get him. Can you see? Like, you need to see his whole body and his beard. He's so cute. So this guy was, um, he's actually kind of fancy. I got him at the bay and he's like the Gluckstein home brand, but he was 50% off. So he was $15 and I just love him. So yeah, that's all the like little decor things that I got. I'm probably going to get more like as I start decorating and seeing what's missing, I'll get more stuff and you guys will see that in another video because I am trying to do like, I guess like a vlogmas type thing. Let me know if you have any suggestions of uh, videos that you want to see because pretty much these are going up in real time since I wasn't like really prepared for this and I don't have like pre-filmed videos but yeah I do have one going up tomorrow which will be my fall empty so I hope you guys stick around for that and if you like this video give it a like and subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you tomorrow.